what's client server architecture and why you should understand it before starting to build your next web application or software as a service. Imagine you are the restaurant. The client is like you, the customer, who makes an order. The menu is like the list of services available that you can request. On the other side, you've got the server acting like the kitchen staff who prepare your order and send it back to you. Every time you want something new, a drink, dessert, or the bill, you, the client, makes a request to the server and they respond with exactly what you asked for. In terms of computers, your laptop or phone is the client and the server is a powerful computer somewhere are there in the world. When you search for something online or access an app, your device sends a request to the server. The server process that request, decide what info you need and sends it back. This back and forth interaction keeps everything in check and ensure you get the right result every time. So in a nutshell, client and server architecture is just like a restaurant visit. Request and response, plain and simple.